Further northeast you went, the more snow you saw. We sent RTV6 reporter Tanya Spencer to Randolph County where schools canceled. No matter what their age, a lot of people here in Winchester spend their day digging out from nine inches of snowfall. It's the kind of snow that's wet and heavy, making it a challenge to move. Zach Wysong spent his day off school helping his grandfather clear the sidewalks. Oh, the snow, it's freezing, it's sticky, it's clogging up our snow plower. It's crazy. As six year old Madison and nine year old Alexis found out, even playing in it was work. Are you getting tired? Yeah. <laughs> Is it heavy? Yeah. So heavy, they downsized their design. What was going to be a snowman became something that didn't require lifting. We had built a snow caterpillar. A snow caterpillar? Yeah. <laughs> what do you think of having the day off school? Pretty good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Is playing in the snow better than going to school? Yeah. But the snow means business for Gerald Beard. Starting at sunup, he's making cash for clearing driveways. This is about my fourth time out, actually. So it's not been real good for the, for the whole season, but it's keeping me busy anyway. So you don't want it to melt? No, no, I don't. <laughs> I want it to keep snowing. It can snow a couple more weeks. It wouldn't hurt me. Some people didn't even bother digging out. They just stayed inside waiting for those warmer temperatures to melt all this snow by this weekend. Reporting in Randolph County, Tanya Spencer, RTV6. Snowplow drivers were hard at work all night and all day today there. So road crews, roads should be back in good shape for schools to be back in session tomorrow.